You're of no particular interest to me, Uthgrim Redaxe. It's the Harbinger I want. Give her to me, and perhaps I will let you leave this accursed city. Weakling. I should have guessed that southern witch had you caught in her web. She thought she could bend me to her will with her gifts and her honeyed lies. As though I needed the help of a sorceress to win the Blood God's favor and lead us of our cool's horde. When Prague fell, I consecrated its streets with the blood of innocence. When the demons gathered to feast, I subjugated them and was exalted in the eyes of Korn. He gifted me with this axe to bring death and ruin upon the old world. I told the witch that if she stayed in Prague, I would hang her head from my belt. She has gone to the Forest of Knives to seek the champion of Slanish. Her pretty lies will serve her well there. Then it appears you have nothing left to bargain with. Ooh, you think I fear death? I offer it freely as a gift to Korn. Blood for the Blood God! <laughs>
should conserve. Magic is not ready. Leave the axe to me, elf. Do not touch it, lest you forfeit your soul. Ass against flames. Take it away, witch hunter. I want nothing to do with it. Your courage and skill have saved a great many lives, young prince. Othgrim Redaxe is dead, and his warband has been scattered. It will take many years, I suspect, but Gorchev and his people now have a real chance at rebuilding Prague. Perhaps, High Lord Master, but the Harbinger continues to elude us. Did Uthgrim tell you anything before he died? She offered him the remnants of Azavar Kool's horde, the same as she did to Kessler. Redax threatened to hang her head from his belt, so she fled. He said she'd gone seeking the followers of Slanish in the Forest of Knives. I've never heard of such a place. I would not expect you to. 
It's an ancient place, deep in the frozen wilds of Norska. An elven city used to stand there, long before the coming of chaos. If the gods are with us, I may be able to open its waystone and allow us to travel there. There's one more thing. Arthgrim referred to the Harbinger as that southern witch. What do you suppose that means? From Arthgrim's perspective, anyone not from the Chaos Wastes is a southerner. If she's not from the Chaos Wastes, then she's of the Old World. Perhaps even a citizen of the Empire. It would explain how she was able to recruit Kessler and carry out the attack at Nuln. <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. If she were from Nuln, the witch hunters would have found her and dealt with her long before she'd become a threat. We'll know the truth soon enough. For now, let's return to the forest. I must make preparations for the next phase of our journey.